Today I'm going to try another Pinterest recipe and this time it's going to be for breakfast sausage. Again, never made sausage but the one time with the Italian sausage. And so, just trying this. What it calls for is one and a half teaspoons of rubbed sage, one half teaspoon of thyme, one teaspoon of ground black pepper, one and a half teaspoons of sea salt, or this is uh, pink Himalayan salt, but okay, that'll work too, it's sea salt, I think. I don't know, it doesn't matter, salt. <laughs> one and a half teaspoon of parsley flakes, which we like this better, it's got more minerals and stuff in it. And um, one quarter cup of, no, one quarter teaspoon of red pepper flakes. You put a quarter cup in here and you're going to be some hot people. And then one quarter teaspoon of ground nutmeg. And I have found out that it's about a quarter of one of these little, well, this one anyway. This one actually is bigger than this one was. So you really can't judge that. But anyway, you just grind you up a little nutmeg. This is two pounds of ground pork, and I'm going to put everything in here. And the way I'm going to do this, I'm just going to mix it up, and then I'm not going to cook it all. Let me go ahead and get this on. I'm just going to cook part of it, but I'm going to do it in like in patties, like for breakfast, biscuits, or whatever you want to do. And um, I'm going to just do it in patties, and then whatever I have left, I'm going to leave raw. Because it actually says you can cook it immediately, but if you refrigerate it for 3 to 24 hours and let the flavors blend together, that it's better. So what we're going to do is we're going to um, just go ahead and cook up a little bit of it and try the rest some other time. Probably, in, I don't know when, so I may not video it. If I remember, I will video it, what the results of the flavor is. Or I may just go back and tell in the description if I can remember after it's tasted. But anyway, just mix it all together. It's two pounds of pork. I think I said that, but I want to make sure you know that. And this is another Pinterest recipe. And this time, because I am making patty sausage and I am not um, scrambling it, I'm going to try to make sure it's a little bit more mixed because whenever you scramble it, it mixes in the pan some, but this way it won't be, you know, it won't have the opportunity to mix properly in the pan. So I'm going to go ahead and give it a good thorough mix in the bowl better than I did with the Italian, which the Italian was a hit. So let's see. I'm going to take and get it off these gloves. I'm going to swap gloves. Take these off. And I wanted, the reason why I'm taking my gloves off is because I forgot to spray. I want to spray this a little bit with some um, olive oil just to make sure it doesn't, I didn't pump it enough, but just to make sure it doesn't stick to this. And I don't need this either. I said I did, but I don't. I got confused about what I was doing. I need this instead. So I'm going to put another pair of gloves on. And I'm actually going to put a little bit of olive oil on these gloves because I don't want this meat to stick like it did with the other just now. But I want to get it done before I start in the meat. Alright. Now I'm just going to get some meat and pat it out into little pieces about like that. And I'm going to put it in this pan. And I'm going to cook it and then I'm going to get my guinea pigs to try it. And if we don't like this recipe, there's probably thousands more. But I'm going to cook just a few pieces of it, maybe like four pieces of it, just to see how it is. And then the rest of it I'm going to go ahead and pat out and put in the refrigerator. I may put it in the freezer. 
or I may go ahead and just put it in the refrigerator. But I think I may freeze it. Alright, so I'm going to let that cook up and make it some more just to put away for a later day. And I'll get back to you when it's done and let you know what it looks like and what the people think about it. Oh no, I can't see your head. There we go. Now probably can't see me. Okay, this is what the breakfast sausage looks like. Can you see it, Selena? Mm -hmm. God, it's burning my finger. <laughs> let me do it like this. This is what the breakfast sausage looks like after it's cooked. And we got the super tall guinea pig here. And he's going to try it. Because Mama says so. That may not be big enough. It smells good. Don't. It could be too hot. What do you think? Taste familiar? It's supposed to taste like breakfast sausage, not Italian it sausage. Is it good? Okay. So, I'm going to. Oh, he's coming too. I'm going to give him a bite too because he's the other guinea pig. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's smoking. Try to link the recipe below if I can. If not, I'll just type it out. Um, <laughs> it's good. If you like what you see, just let me know. If you have a recipe for breakfast sausage, um, let me know in the comments. If um, also, if you like, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, uh, and share this video if somebody else may be looking for a sausage recipe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.